Hello everybody, I'm Todd Hutzman right here at Airstream of South Florida. We're a proud division of North Trail RV right here in Fort Myers, Florida. And today I just want to briefly go over with you this beautiful B plus, they call it, um, Airstream Atlas. A lot of you may have seen it in some of our videos before. This is a brand new 2025 with that very popular interior, which we'll get into the modern garage. Um, got a lot of nice features on here, like all of them. Um, there's been some changes with the company, with the factory, and I think you'll find that the body style or the body that's been out is the same one, but you're going to find some vast improvements in it. The sleep finish is a little bit higher quality than what we have seen in, in past years, and I think you'll find it a very nice feature. This unit has a lot of great things. Um, for a small couple's coach, it still manages to have some storage. That's a vent area. Um, that is for the generator. One of the big changes they did on these new Atlas is they've changed them from the diesel generators, which was nice because it fed off that main tank, but they were a little loud. You could feel the vibration where these are these ultra quiet propane generators and they're programmable. Or of course you can also upgrade and go to the E1 all lithium system and not have a generator at all. This one's got extra storage here. It's got a unique thing. It does have a panel up here that can lift up if you wanted to put in a bag of golf clubs and need that extra height. It's set up for that. Also, you also have this basement little miniature compartment. I see a lot of guys carrying fuel treatments, antifreeze, a few tools, whatever you want, you can fit in here. And then the best storage we'll make our way around to is on the other side. Um, of course, like all air streams, it does have the, uh, the, the hitch behind it. This can tow up to 4,000 pounds, um, and it is hidden. Airstream doesn't like to have them exposed. It's just kind of a step in the right direction to keep it sleek and automotive styling. Um, we come around over here, and this here is your utility area. Easy to access. Um, has a macerator hose so you don't have that big three inch dump hose to deal with gravity feed. This has a complete pump system. It's very clean and efficient. Of the least favorite part of RVing, this makes it a whole lot nicer. Also, there's your fill center right there below it with the yellow cap for any propane fill center to, to reload with propane while you're out on the road. A lot of the truck service centers have that as well because many of the semis are equipped that way. This is the storage for a small unit that I'm happy with. Some of you are familiar with it, those of you who are not. It is connected all the way through. So if you're putting in some longer bag chairs, that type of thing, you have a way to do it. Hopefully it's a bright, hot, sunny Florida day. The camera can pick that up to some degree. And then I saved one of the more important things here before we step inside on these Airstream Atlas. They're now building them exclusively on the 4,500 pound chassis. So go ahead and load your gear, load your friends, go somewhere that can seat four people. You don't have to worry about being overloaded. It can hold another thousand pounds over the 3,500 pound chassis. So I may have understated that, might be a little over that. Let's come around here. We're gonna make our way to the inside. On our way in though, I do want to show you guys, this is kind of a nice feature. A lot of people always ask us, it's right here on camera. This comes with a three year, 36,000 mile warranty from Airstream, five years, 75,000 mile on the chassis by Mercedes Benz and 100,000 miles by Mercedes Benz on the engine and drivetrain. Okay, we come on up. Another thing you'll notice as we come inside is there's no step well in here. Those stairs fold up when we're inside, nice clean automotive styling, and you don't have to worry about tripping and falling into a step well on the inside. Um, a thing I don't ever show people, and I need to, is how comfortable this is. And you can tell I like comfort. You sit here, if you wanna get an idea, this has an awesome recliner right here. Perfect to sit here. It's got a telescoping TV. You can't get much more comfortable than this in a small area. And then another push of the button. And I want to show you guys because we don't usually do that. I'm going to take just a moment and I'm going to put this 
bed down to show you how easy it is to set up your bed. You're tired. You guys have hit the road. You've stopped somewhere just for an overnight stay on your road trip. It's just a few seconds and your bed is down. And with the travel straps on it and your bedding in place, you don't have to make the bed. You just pull a lever on the side of the sofa right here and pull this bed, lay it down. You would have your bedding on. Obviously, this is brand new, so we leave the plastic on to keep it clean. It's two straps. You unsnap them, grab your pillows out from back, pull your blankets back, flip that down. You're ready for bed. It just doesn't get any easier than that. You're all done. Make your bed up in the morning. Drop your pillows in. Put your travel straps back on. Pull that release lever. Lift this up. You're done. You can put this up. Nice thing about it is if you're traveling, even with the slide in, that bed can come down. If you're just beat and you just want to put it down and crawl in bed, you don't even want to spend 15 seconds to put the slide out. You don't have to. But you see there, I'm not in the greatest shape and I just did it in a few seconds. So it's not hard to do. Also, these seats turn around to become part of the salon area as well. In this compartment right here is two, two table tops. You can put a table here and a table here. It's not one at either or. You get two tables and the posts are put away in the closet. We walk through here. Here's your telescoping TV. You don't have to leave it up. It can go down with the push of a button. And then we come to this little kitchen area. It's pretty nice. It's got a Corian countertop. It's got your wastebasket there. This is to give you, these covers, they help to give you extra counter space. If you're just not cooking, maybe you're putting a salad together or, or uh, some sandwiches. You've even got an extension below my belly right here. So that'll work. If you do want to cook something, there's your stove. If you want to microwave something, this is also not only a microwave, but a power convection oven as well. So yeah, you can do biscuits and gravy on the road in a luxury coach like this. You've got a 12 volt fridge, which is awesome. Draws about and a large freezer area that will keep ice cream and ice in it. Um, it does work about 30% more efficient than a propane fridge does as far as draw off the batteries. And it gets a whole lot colder faster. You work your way back here. Okay, one of my favorite parts about the Airstream Atlas is this residential style bathroom. It gives you a nice stand up, fully enclosable shower with plenty of room to move around in and a little separate toilet area. You got a great sink vanity, also medicine cabinet as well that's got a lot of space. Um, so it makes it really nice to use. You come over here, you're gonna see in one of the closets, they're cedar lined. So moths can be a problem in Florida, maybe not in Oregon, but the rest of the Eastern seaboard, definitely moths can be a problem, but not with this one. We're thinking ahead, we put cedar in there to keep the moths out. Lots of space there. We close this little medicine cabinet. Shoot, that's bigger than the one I have that my wife allots me at my house. And then you have this one here and these shelves are adjustable. This is the one where it can come up if you're putting golf clubs in from outside. And then this one I should go back to is also adjustable. And you can see it's got a rod holder to hold a lot of clothes. So you have great storage in this unit between the outside and inside. A couple truly can travel in comfort. I want to thank everybody who took this quick journey with me through the Airstream Atlas. This is the 2025 with the modern Grege interior. Some people call it modern Grege, so we'll call it modern Grege or modern Grege. Either way, it's a beautiful, very popular interior. I want to thank you guys again um, for joining me here at Airstream of South Florida, a proud division of North Trail RV right here in Fort Myers, Florida. I want to thank you for watching this video, and if you'd like to see more videos like this one, well, all you have to do is like and subscribe on that button right there. And my name is Todd Utzman. Um, you can call me directly at 877-554-9955. Please feel free to hit our website, airstreamofsouthflorida.com. We are at the intersections of I-75 and exit 141, Fort Myers, Florida.